guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to be doing a try on fall haul. I got some super cute pieces, so if you're interested in what I got, then just keep watching. So first I'm going to start with TJ Maxx and Marshalls. I did get a few things from there because they always have the best deals and the cutest stuff. So, you know, I got some stuff. So first I got this striped crop top and then it has like the... What is that detail called? Ruffle? Yeah, I think it's called a ruffle. It has like the little ruffle details at the top on the sleeves and on the bottom. This was $7.99 and I got mine in a size large. So next thing I got is this super freaking cute button down shirt. It has like the little collar. I usually wouldn't go for something like this because I feel like collars look weird on me. But this one fit wicked cute. The only thing that's kind of annoying is the sleeves go down like super low so you can see like your side boob in it. So you have to wear a cami under it but... It's not too bad. This was $12.99 and I got it in a size large. The last shirt that I got from TJ Maxx is just this plain black t-shirt with the crisscross detail. I got this in a size large and this was $6.99. So moving on to Marshalls, the first thing I picked up from there was this baseball tee with the stripes on the sleeve. I needed some basic t-shirts so I picked up a few and this was $6.99 and I got this in a size medium. Next I got this tank top and I know it's a tank top but it's very thick material um, and obviously I'm going to wear it with a cardigan or a jean jacket. By the way, a lot of my stuff is black and white. It's kind of all I buy. Can't really help it, but keep going with black and white. And this was $5.99 and I got it in a size medium. I actually haven't tried this on yet, so hopefully it's cute on. We'll see. Next I got this very different piece. So I got this sheer shirt and then it has flowers embroidered on. But yeah, this was $9.99 and I got this in a size medium. Then I picked up, yes guys, it's black and white. But the best thing about this shirt is that this part comes sewn together so you don't gotta worry about your girls falling out or anything. So I thought that was a good detail. And I really liked the sleeves. They're like a tassel. I think that's what they're called. Yeah, it's like a tassel detail on it. And then the bottom of it cinches at the waist which I thought was kind of weird like looking at it off the, the hanger but when you put it on it's not bad because you just tuck under that piece you'll see what I mean when I try it but this was $12.99 and I got this in a size small the next thing I picked up from Marshalls is just this plain white cardigan and I needed one that wasn't um, knitted. A lot of my cardigans are all knitted so I needed one that was just like a normal material. It does have this like striped material on the sleeve shoulder part and then going down the side as well it has that same material and it is long enough and it covers your booty so you can wear leggings. And I got this in a size large and this was $16.99. The last thing I got from Marshalls I'm in love with. Just let's look at it. Like, I don't have any color like this. I had to have it. I kind of hate that it says Calvin Performance. I really just wish it said Klein. Just comfy to wear with leggings, a pair of sneakers, vans, and you're all set on a lazy day. And 
and your girl got it for $24.99 and I got this in a size large. Next I went to Primark and I only found two things there. Usually I always find so much stuff. This time I only got two things. It's this mustard yellow and navy blue flannel. I just loved the color on this. Um, and this was only $9 so I was like this is mine. All my flannels are like black or I have one red one. I don't have anything this color. I got this in a US size 12. I don't like to wear them buttoned because I have a bigger chest, so buttons just don't work for me. And the next thing I got from them are just these gray joggers. And it has the rose gold details on the string. And guys, these are so soft. Like I was surprised because sometimes their quality Obviously isn't the best, but these are like super soft and these were only $8 and I got these in a US 10, size 10. Next I went to Charlotte Russe and I got three things from there. So first I got this super freaking cute cardigan. I love this color. It's like a burnt orange color. The sleeves are like puffy and then it cinches in at your wrist. It looks better on. It looks kind of weird when you show it, but it looks fine when you wear it. And then it just has the normal buttons going down. And you guys, I got this on sale. You'll never guess how much I paid for this. I'm just going to take a second so you can guess because you're never going to guess how much I paid for it. We'll just look at the tag. I literally paid $2.99 for this cardigan. $2.99. Literally. For a fall cardigan. Mind you, this is knitted. This was originally $28.99 and I got it for $3. So, you know, your girl's always finding steals. Um, next for clothes, the only thing I got is a pair of black leggings. Can't go wrong with black leggings. Theirs aren't as bad as Forever 21, so I always pick up a pair from Charlotte Russe. I got these in a size large, and these were $8.99. Lastly, from Charlotte Russe, I just got an accessory. It's like a light pink color with, I think it's gold, yeah, with gold detail, and then it has silver around all the flowers. I don't know if you can really tell. Next, I went to Aeropostale. I know, I literally haven't shopped there in years, but they were having 60% off the whole entire store. And I, I, I couldn't resist, I walked in and they actually had some cute stuff. So the first thing I got from there is this long sleeve shirt. Um, it's kind of like a sweater because it's boyfriend fit and it just says New York on it and then it says all of the cities of New York written at the bottom. And this ran so big. I had to go down to a size small. I never tried jeans from there. It was my first time. These jeans were literally like originally 50 something dollars and they were all on sale for like 13. So I was like, okay, let me try these on. And I'm so happy I did because they're so soft and so comfortable. And they fit me really well. I did have to go up two sizes. So if you are ordering online, make sure you go up a few sizes. I normally wear an eight to a 10. I had to get these in a 12. Um, but yeah, the 12 fit me perfect. It's just this dark wash jean. It has like a few little rips in the corners, but it's not ripped all the way down. The rest of it is all plain and I needed some jeans that weren't ripped. Lord knows all my jeans are ripped, so I needed some that weren't ripped. And yeah, I got these in a size 12 regular, which is also weird because I always get all of my jeans from American Eagle and I usually get a short because I'm 5'2". Then I got this pair of jeans. I needed a light wash pair. And these were so cute. Same thing, they don't really have any rips on it, just on the sides. And then they're not ripped the whole way down. Of course, these are skinny jeans. I don't want anything else. And I got these in the same size, a size 12 regular. Except these ones are high-waisted. 
um so they come up like right below your belly button those ones are i think low rise yeah those ones were low rise if i didn't say it these are both jagging too by the way but the low rise isn't really low rise that's all i got from air apostle lastly i went to american eagle and i just got one pair of jeans because american eagle jeans are the best but i just got this medium wash jean and it has like the fake rips so it's not really ripped it's just fabric behind it to cover it there's one real rip here but it's like pretty small but i just thought these were different i don't have anything like this and i needed a, like i said a medium wash and i was trying to get no rips technically these are ripped there's just one little rip and the rest of them are fake freezing here in Massachusetts during the winter so I wanted to get some that weren't ripped all the way down so the last two things I have to show you are shoes just look how cute just look these are so freaking nice I love these sneakers they're so comfortable so let me just start off by saying that these are memory foam wore these once I couldn't help myself I took them out the second I bought them and the back of them have these like stripe design going up and then they just say spurry on them but they're all gray all around and I didn't really have any gray sneakers okay well I have one pair of gray sneakers but this is the darker shade of gray I have a horrible shoe problem little fact about me all I do is buy shoes it's literally horrible I'm surprised that this haul even exists because all I buy is shoes. Like, I'm serious. Like, all I buy is shoes. I got one more pair of sneakers. You're either gonna love them or you're gonna hate them. I love them. I got a pair of viewers. I thought they were so freaking cute. Of course, cute. That's all I know to say. I just got the all white pair. And then the detail on them is in blue. Um, which I thought that I didn't mind it. They were a little cheaper than the all white ones, so I just went for these. And I just love these. My boyfriend hates them. He made fun of me because I bought them. Okay guys, so that's everything that I got for this haul. So I hope you enjoyed watching and I hope you liked everything that I got. I'm gonna try to link everything that I had down below. It's gonna be a little hard with TJ Maxx and Marshalls, but I'll try my best to find what I can. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more videos. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.